Give it up for darkness. Let him hear it, please. What? Hey, fuck you. You're Mexican. Don't th she could say fuck me. Not you. What the, I'm not afraid of cholos. What the fuck? You know where we're at, bro? We're at the, we're at the fucking mills, dog. You know how many cops are walking around? They're not even working right now. They're like, hey, so let's go fucking shoot somebody. Not even afraid of your neck tattoos. You get a neck tattoo, you're just trying not to get a job, huh, loco? And your girl's over there. When you apply for the job, go like that. Don't, don't go like that. Why do you want to work here to be a part of the Walmart family? You know what I'm saying? Are you done now? Because uh, you talk shit. I got to fucking say shit, all right? I'm sorry, bro. When you yell out shit, if I don't say shit back, I look like a bitch. So I had to make you look like one. You get my point? You know what I'm saying? If, uh, both fighters can't win, bro. You didn't get that one, Loca, or what? She's not even paying attention. She's stirring her shit right. Hey, Loca, this ain't TV. I'm really here. You mad about something or what? We could talk about it. I just had a 30-second conversation about a neck tattoo. What? I did, bro. What the fuck? Everybody laughed, dog. When I said Walmart family, everybody laughed. You want to see it again or what? I'll rewind, bro. What the fuck? Why are you talking shit, dog? You're the one with a fucking tattoo on your neck. You just say you don't want a job, huh? And your girl's all mad. You see, want me to do it slower? Why you got a tattoo on your neck, dog? You're just trying not to get a job. Your girls are, when you go to the interview, make sure you're like that. Don't go like that. Cause she gonna fucking see it. Are you done, fucker, or what? <laughs> Stop it, dick. If you gonna make your own jokes, why'd you come here? What? You're from Puente, too? I know, but I don't live there no more, shit. Yeah, I love La Puente. I don't live there no more. I like my rims. Fuck that shit. I fucking left La Puente and went to La Verne. Fuck that shit. I ain't worried about cops and cholos. I'm worried about PTA and fucking soccer moms. <laughs> you didn't get that one? Away. You okay, bro? Like... <laughs> Oh, oh, you're from Laverne? Get the fuck out. The whitest fucking place on the planet, huh? Oh my God, it's, so it's not fucking regular white guys. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know white people. Hey, what's up? Bro? Hey, Brad. Hey, what's up, bro? How you doing, dude? No, they're fucking absolutely <laughs> fucking rich. <laughs> oh my God, look at the Mexicans moved in. <laughs> They try to blame their gardeners for shit on us, huh? No. They, 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 they told their cousins it was an available home. <laughs> you didn't get that one? You don't want to look at me or what? I trip out. The whole fucking front row never wants to look at me. I mean, you don't need me, bro. Fuck, what the fuck? You trying to be my friend right now, dick? I have enough friends. No, I got white friends and fucking Asian friends. I make money now. I don't need Mexican friends no more. I got fucking family. I got family here. My fucking brother Joe's back there. Fucking, my, where the Aquinos at? Where you guys at? And there they are right there. See, I got, I got plenty of family loco on the real, man. No, you don't need, I don't, you don't need, we're, I know, we're family, bro, like, but far, though. You know what I'm saying? If I got married again, which I'm not, but uh, you'd be like the farthest table, like. What's that? From what? What is it? I don't take tequila, bro. Fuck that shit. What is it? It's Tito's? I'll take that shit. Fuck yeah. See? Another cousin. I got him a job here. Why are you trying to be all special right now, dick? Fuck, man. 
There was like 350 people other than you here. Why are you trying to have a conversation, Dave? Are you lonely? Call me now. Call the fucking psychic network. I got it, white guy. This is not us, all right? You know what I'm saying? You know how you watch a fucking, like a toothpaste commercial and they're all one out of five? Oh, the black guy's mad. Are you mad, bro? Who are you? Man, you ain't even talking about us. Shit. <laughs> Don't get mad at me. I hired Bruce. <laughs> Plenty of other Mexicans that tell jokes. I picked the black guy. <laughs> and I got to give him a ride home. Ain't this a bitch? <laughs> oh, shit. You got black backup right here. She's a little older, too. It's like, you're not old. You're older, all right? I hate that. Wait a minute. I'm not older. What do you mean I'm older? What the fuck? If you're five and your brother is nine, he's older. It's not an insult, you ancient bitch. That's an insult. <laughs> Where you at, Bruce? You know you're not supposed to walk around by the curtains. I'm serious, Bruce. Don't fuck around, dog. Bruce. Bruce. Oh, fuck. Stop it. I told you, bro. Both eyes open, one palm out. <laughs> Are you okay, white people? White people okay? Are the white people okay? Seriously. Because Mexicans and blacks, we say when we're mad. Oh, fuck that shit. That nigga ain't gonna talk shit about me and this motherfucker. Right then and there, you know it, huh? White people don't do that shit. They go home and write emails. <laughs> to whom it may concern. I was at the Ontario Improv last night and was not pleased. <laughs> What's your name, black guy? So I'm gonna call you black guy. Your name, sir. I'm not a cop, trust me. If I was, this whole room would be arrested. <laughs> starting, <laughs> starting right there, fuck. <laughs> this fucking vato, he's trying to go back to work tomorrow and be like, yeah, I was special last night, eh? <laughs> Mario to janitorial, Mario, that's me, eh? <laughs> but last night I was special, eh? <laughs> you don't even know, eh? Look at special. Well, shut the fuck up, dick. We got a camera right on you right now. You're going to look extra stupid. Tam tam mañana, bro. Look, look at you. That man, that, uh, retarded, bro. And I'm not saying retarded because I got a cousin. I'm saying he's going to watch this video and go, he's fucking stupid. <laughs> See, they're already trying to kick you out, bro. I'm telling you. And, uh, hey, bro, on the real, you know, uh, you look like a special guy, but... uh. This is a pretty expensive ticket. Why are you going to yell out shit and get thrown out and then watch the video of you getting thrown out tomorrow on YouTube? <laughs> but some guys like that, they feel special to how. They check it out. Check out how I fought. No. <laughs> Bro, on the real, just be quiet and laugh, okay? <laughs> oh, look at the, like, the black people are tripping out. Like, man, I feel like I'm in a theater in Inglewood. Motherfuckers be yelling out shit. You know what's funny? No, I never go to a black fucking theater because black people yell out the movie. Oh, fuck that shit. <laughs> that ain't right, I'm a star. Like he wouldn't have stabbed the motherfucker. <laughs> but sometimes you have to go if it's an F.E. movie because black people are sometimes are funnier than the movie. <laughs> I went to go see some movie, Bounce. That movie was bullshit. Then black people behind me. Oh, man, this movie's bullshit. Keisha, pass the hot sauce. What the fuck? <laughs> Don't go in that cave. I'm like looking at the manager. Hey, could these tears turn around? Because that fucking dude's hilarious. <laughs> I don't know who bought me this, but thank you very much. I'm, I'm here with you guys. We had a long weekend. <laughs> and you guys are a great crowd for Sunday. Fucking Sunday shows always fucking suck. Everybody, oh, tomorrow I'll be at work tomorrow. <laughs> and Michelle's my manager. She's a bitch. Bernie don't start till Thursday.
I didn't get your name black. I'm sorry. Well, I'm sorry. What? Roy. Okay, that's a, that's that's an easy question, bro. That's a cool name, Roy. Do you have a black name, baby? Do you have a black name? Is it is it? A, did it have a sure car or a la in it? You know, see, you laughed your hardest. I, I did the corner of my. I name all my kids Chuck Lloyd. <laughs> What's your name, man? What's your name, man? What? Lakita. <laughs> you don't understand, all right? Anybody that says that Mexicans don't like black people don't fucking have a clue. We love fucking black people. On the real, you guys got the best weed. You guys are the shit. We know. I, I hate that shit. I watch the news. You know, black and Mexican tension. No, I fuck no. Shit. You like our hot sauce? We like your chicken. I mean, fuck. The fuck? We don't fucking hate black. I never had that in my family. Oh, you fucking nigger. Why the fuck? Fuck no. We love shit. They're black. They're kind of let them in, eh? They brought the hot sauce, eh? We're going to give them the salsa. They're going to teach us how to make the ribs. If anybody says that about Mexicans, black people, if you hear that about us, fuck no. We love you guys. On the real. You, you think there's a fucking Mexican without a Laker jersey in L.A.? Shit. There's no Mexican plane, but we got your back. <laughs> Without black people, this country would suck ass. It would. Football would be all slow. Oh, basketball, no dunks, all three-pointers. The Olympics, no gold medals. Fucking Laverne, you can't run. We'd have like archery and swimming, that's it. <laughs> Here's to you, La Laquita. And all the black people, Roy and your girl right there. Here's to all the black people here. You make America greater than it already is. Because you guys are fucking fast. You guys fucking run, fuck. You're the reason why the police got a dog. The dog can't even catch you, huh? Did you get him? Oh. What happened? Yeah, that's oh. <laughs> I'll let you calm down after that one. There's a few Karens in here. I feel bad, huh, for the name Karen. You know, back in the 70s, you know, you named Karen. Now your name is Karen, and they go, well, Karen's out there, I'm a Karen. <laughs> you didn't like that one, Lakita? <laughs> is your husband right here, your boyfriend, your son, your, your ride? I don't <laughs> Who is that to you, babe? What? I'm, I'm sorry, this is a weird situation. Because you look like a black planter. He looks like an Aryan nation. He looks like a tagger. And she looks like a fucking Instagram influencer. If you got that shit, then you're fucking having the free time like I do. So what's going on? I'm going to ask you, babe, what's, what's going on? No, uh, do you know them? He, that's your dad. Okay, see, we're figuring it out. Okay, and who is she? What? I know Lakita's name, bro. You're not helping yourself. There's a cop here somewhere. If Lakita goes down, we all go down. I got it, Roy, relax. No, it's okay, we have a scapegoat. No, me and you, Roy, will be in the front. He's like, I don't know what's going on, motherfucker. And I'll be like, hey, it's that vato with a tattoo right here in the neck. That don't have a job, eh? I'm with the Walmart family, bitch. 
Okay, so who is that to you? Your boyfriend? Fiance. Oh, you're getting married? Hey, a good idea. <laughs> How old are you? How old are you, bro? 21. 21? Stupid motherfucker. <laughs> Look at her dad is clapping. <laughs> and Lakita's going, oh, shut the fuck up, man. I want this bitch to move out. I want this Aryan all to myself. Yeah, Lakita's gonna turn to lick it real quick, like. Get this bitch out the house. That shit was funny, okay? Remember, I make this shit up as I go along, all right? It's like opening a pillow, all the feathers fly out. When it goes out, I can't bring them back. 21, getting married. You have kids or what? No kids? No kids. You have no obligation whatsoever. And you're getting married. You are the stupidest fuck. What? He's not laughing no more. He's looking at you. Exactly. Don't get fucking married. Kick it for a few years, dude. Relax. Fuck. You don't want to know a divorce, bro. Clap if you're a divorce. You see how, how loud that clap is? That's the worst thing that can happen to you ever, bro. You know what my mom said? My mom said, mijo, and you know what divorce is like? It's like the, 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 somebody died in the family, but they're still alive. <laughs> What's your name, bro? Brian. What? Brian. Brian. Fucking Brian. We're getting married. <laughs> and I know why you're marrying her, because fucking you found her, and she's hotter than you could get. <laughs> and you're like, fuck, maybe if I marry her, she'll stay. Don't work like that, loco. Hit the gym, dog. Get all sexy. You know what I'm saying? Fucking beat pump that shit. Just don't get, don't get fat and don't get no tattoos on you. I'm, you know what? He didn't see that one coming, huh? When he started earlier, he thought I was going to be like, okay, bad jab, jab, now, bah! Bro, on the real, you're fucking retarded, okay? You're fucking stupid. Do not get married right now. Wait, bro. Wait, wait. Hey, you wanna come? No, I don't want to come to your fucking funeral. <laughs> bro, I'm, I know what I'm going to do, bro. Me and my fucking ex chick, because she fucking divorced too. And we, my, my chick's back there, she's divorced too. And we laugh. Like, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> she's probably back there going, fucking dumbass, fucking Brian. <laughs> she's going to take your fucking heart and shove it back up your ass. You know why she can't take it out and keep it? Because she has to put it back, because she has to put, pay child support. She needs you alive, dick. Come on, you know that shit was funny. They have no idea. Are you divorced or what? No? You never got married? You got married and you're still married? I'm widowed. Widowed? Oh, see? She lucked out. He died. Fuck you, that was funny. If she went like this, if she went, I would agree. I'd be like, I'm so sorry, ma'am. What's your bill? I'll pay it. But she went. When a widowed woman doesn't cry when I say she lucked out and died. Do you understand my point, motherfucker? Holy shit, huh? Do I have to make any more points about fucking marriage? Shit! Wait till you're in court, bro. Wait till you, uh, are there any divorced women here? Divorced women. There, okay. I'm gonna hook up with one of you chicks. <laughs> nah, because odds are uh, they took half their husband's shit. My ex-wife took half my shit, so together we'll have whole shit again. <laughs> That's my e-harmony. What's up, bitch? You got couches? I got a TV. I'm telling you, bro, I'm, just think about it. You're very young, bro. You can live with her for the next 10 years, right? Right, Dad? The next 10 years, bro. On the real, I'll do a benefit on the 8th. On the 8th year, you know, we're running low on rent. If she's still there, I'll do a benefit for your rent, dog. Fuck yeah. I will fucking do a benefit for you if she's still there. I'm telling you right now that she's on a Harley in three years. 
And you're going, where'd she go, dad? And he's gonna be like, how much your dad no more, bitch? Get to the gym, get a good job, what the fuck? My God, my divorce was a motherfucker. Oh my God, I, I, I don't wish my divorce on my ex-wife and I hate that bitch. That bitch won every time. I had, okay, I had a Mexican lawyer. There's some things you don't let Mexicans do. There's some things Mexicans are really good at. Tile. <laughs> Fix your brakes. Lawyer, nah. <laughs> fucking, my, my ex-wife fucking lawyer walked in with an Armani suit. That motherfucker looked powerful. <laughs> he talked like a fucking powerful white man. I specialize in divorce. My lawyer's in fucking tres hermanos. Fucking ostrich boots and shit. And he's all, I, I, I do DUI and immigration también. <laughs> Shittiest lawyer ever. Got me my kids half the time. What the fuck? I want it every other weekend like my friends got. <laughs> now that I see him every fucking weekend and shit. And they say the same shit. They come to my house, Dad, we're hungry. We're hungry, Dad. Well, so am I. Your mom took the refrigerator. <laughs> Are you learning, Brian? I'm just letting you know, Rocco, okay? I know it's lovely right now. But she's really skinny and you're a little fucking little tucked under. <laughs> just don't get attacked. Anyways. You like that one, huh? Because you're, yeah, you're one of the smartest crowd members. I, I, I got that one. I did. She's telling her Laverne husband, I got that one. I got that fucking soul. I got that one. <laughs> Just letting you know, bro. Divorce is a bitch, huh, dad? Hey, you're talking really loud. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, Desperado. Fuck. <laughs> you fucking waiter, fucking Desperado and shit. Look at this shit. Dun, 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 I live with my mother and the don't tell me come in. You didn't get that? Okay, never mind. It's not, not every joke's for everybody. <laughs> but what are you doing, dog? You're walking over there like you're fucking selling tacos and. <laughs> well, give the bills out. Fucking get them. Fucking, you don't know, be all loud and shit. Say Netflix, dick. I'm really here. I'm just letting you know, Brian. Hey, Brian, I'm letting you know. It's the lot of divorce people, and they know what the fuck I'm talking about, bro. I watch Dateline. I watch, like, you know, forensic files and shit like that. And I see these fucking guys that kill their ex-wife. You ever see that shit? Like, these guys, like, plot and kill their ex-wife. I'd never kill my ex-wife. Fuck no. Now I got to watch my kids all the time? You just killed a babysitter, you dumb motherfucker. I don't want nothing happen to my ex-wife. I send that bitch vitamins. <laughs> nah, I'm all right. It's the last night. It's my Friday right now. I'm fucking. I'm, I'm off till fucking Friday next Friday. I know I barely work. I fucking. I feel bad for everybody in this room right now that has to. I don't work, dude. I'm fucking bored, dog. I get mad at Netflix. Load some more shit up. Huh, Lakita. Lakita, Lakita. Should be a song. Anyway. Okay, there's your... I hate when the bills come out. I fucking hate when the bills come out. You know why I hate when the bills come out? This is where the Mexicans and black stop laughing. Nah, fucking Mexicans are like, hey, fucking, that's fucking funny, eh? Kill your ex wifey eh? Fucking, eh? Wait, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? No, nah, we, 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 no, Mexicans, we get mad, but we fucking calm down. Hey, well, okay, I'll take care of it. Fuck you. You got me this time. Black people, you guys, raw, you guys get mad. What the fuck? Hey, nigga, I didn't order tax. <laughs> Who the fuck ordering tax on my shit? <laughs> Look at 
Look at Lakita, don't do that to me, all right? How old are you? How old are you, ma'am? How old are you? What, 23? Oh, I was going to say, I was in dog years. Fuck. Because I'm 47. No, I would, if I had a guess, I would say you're 35. You look 35. I'd hit it two times on Sunday. Anyway. <laughs> look, at, look at Brian. Look at Brian. Daddy, you taking care of this? I'm saving up for a bullshit wedding. <laughs> fucking youngsters, huh? He got laid and he fucking knew I'm keeping it. You didn't find a number one comic book, bro. There's a billion chicks out there. Uh, no, no offense to you. I'm sure you're awesome. And I will talk about your sexual prowess, but your dad is looking at me, and your dad looks like he's buried a body in Hammett. I still got the shovel, motherfucker. I'm just saying, Brian, you're fucking 21, bro. You're fucking retarded. And we know that. You know why we know that? Hey, clap. When you were 21, you knew you were retarded. No, you're 21. You can't clap. See how retarded you are? You clap at the wrong response. Fuck, huh? Right, bro? How old are you, bro? How old are you? 35. 35. See, remember that shit? Remember that? You have to understand, you're going to get older, bro. Remember, life does not end at 30. 21-year-olds think that, huh? And, you know, I'll be 30, and what am I going to do? I'm 40 fucking seven, bro. I feel great. Every once in a while I get up, ah, it hurts, but I'm okay. <laughs> How old are you, dad? 53, see? And still rocking it, huh? Look how sexy that motherfucker is. Shaved his hair, he got a goatee, bought a Harley, and said, fuck your mom. You get my point? You're going to be there, bro. Okay? Life is... Uh, uh, clap if you're over 60 in the room right now. Do you feel old? Fuck, no, he don't. Look at him. He's got a younger chick. Fuck, she's hot, too. Way to be, bro. How'd you get her, man? Would you get an ice cream truck? Okay, the point... <laughs> you didn't get that one away. It's okay. You get my point, bro? When you get older... Remember, remember me and him... What's your name, sir? I'm sorry. What? Joey. Joey. No, you're 53. You're Joe now. <laughs> sorry, bro. You have to cut the Y off at one. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Joey, come meet Timmy and Bobby. No. It's fucking Tim. It's Joe. And it's Bob. No, when he was younger, you don't understand, bro. We know your life already. We know your life. You are a beautiful woman. I'm the real. I would do the same thing. But just string her along for 10 years. Every time she's like, when's the wedding? Buy her a Camry. <laughs> you okay, loca? Or what? You're fucking adding up shit? Like you're, you're fucking old as fuck, huh? You're, oh, shit. I don't remember this. Look at her, Sandra. She's looking at you. Anyway, keep this in mind, all right? You're 21 years old. Sex is everything to you. He's, Joe's 53. I'm 47. He's 65. 65, right? The speed limit? When you're 21, you need sex. You need it. You can't live without it. Fucking, they're all building up in there. When you're our age, you like sex. You don't need it. A 21-year-old will hear a fucking chick will call him in El Monte, right? From El Monte, California, right? All the way down the freeway, right? I want to fuck you. Where you at? I'm in Ontario. Okay, I'll be here. And he'll walk. Well, I will walk. 500 miles and I would walk by. Me and Joe, we ain't walking. We get a call, hey, I want to fuck you. Where you at? El Monte. Well, I'm in Ontario. Okay, I'm in El Monte. Well, let me know when you're in Ontario, bitch. And you want to get married right now. And you want to give up your every other weekend. Fucking ignorance, huh? They should be teaching this shit in class. I, I should get a benefit. 
to go to high schools and say, huh, huh, Troy, Roy, 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 You get my point? I'm like, fuck, dude, I'm fucking, this, I just met this chick, I'm dating her, she's fucking hot as fuck. But, uh, but before I met her, I was being a whore, because that's what this job requires. I'm with this girl, right? I'm fucking with, I'm, I remember I was fucking your age, right? 21 years old, thinking I'm all fucking, boy, I fucking my, I was all ripped up. <laughs> hair, I fucking had the long hair, and the, the top and the back and the sides were all shaved. <laughs> fucking hanging out with a girl, and I'm trying to get with her, and I'm putting my hand right there. She's like, no! <laughs> no! I tried all night. No! I wait for her to go to sleep a little bit. No! All night, no! I hear the fucking chicken, <laughs> fucking six, no! <laughs> try it all night. <laughs> fucking 47 year old Jeff, fuck no. I tried one time, no, I'm a lady. Well, good night, lady. <laughs> I'm leaving. No, <laughs> you should. <laughs> when you leave, put Sports Center on. <laughs> See how Joe's laughing his ass off? but he's still trying to sell you on marrying her? Nah, dick. <laughs> Just string her along, bro. Buy her, buy her things every year. Buy her, don't say stupid shit, bro. Remember, you're a man. You're gonna say stupid shit. And she's a woman. Get a better job, better job, better job. That's how you keep a chick, better job. You want her in eight years going, you know, I can't, if I go anywhere else, I wanna have that. You know what's funny is half of you wanted to laugh at that and half of you were thinking about what you didn't do. I should have stayed with Carlos, fuck. You get my point? You get my point, bro? Think about it, loco. Just look at how hot she is. She might fucking make a calendar and fucking sell millions and where the fuck are you gonna be? At his doorstep saying, Joe, take me back. Okay, I fucking didn't even hear that because if you're gonna talk shit, get a better seat. <laughs> nah, we're good, bro. He just said he had, like, bro, you don't understand, bro. You yell shit out and you try to be funny, it, it doesn't work here. <laughs> Let me tell you why, bro, all right? Because you have a musket, all right? You thought of one thing and you put the musket in them, I'm fucking fired right now. <laughs> I have a machine gun up here. I've been up here for 33 fucking minutes, bro. Well, check it out. <laughs> I just reloaded on your ass. <laughs> you get up and you go <laughs> And you fucking ruined it. We're talking, trying to talk some advice into, what's your name again, I'm sorry? What? Brian, that's right. I, I got it, Cholo. Relax, bro. The only reason you're still alive, Cholo, because you're fucking thick right here. And when you get stabbed, it doesn't hit any vital organs. <laughs> like, you're like, ah, no, no, nothing, dog. Uh, oh, nice try. Oh, you almost hit me. Thank you, brother. Hey, give it up for B1 right here, our head of security. The man right here, you high yellow motherfucker. He's, his dad is black and his mom is French. That's some weird shit right there, huh? How'd that happen, Roy? Can you explain that one or what? No. <laughs> yeah, ho, ho, me, me, wee, wee. What's up, bitch? Lakita, you're just judging me at this point. That's upsetting me, baby, because, because I'm telling a joke and you go, That shit was funny. Look at Mike's not gonna get married now. He's fucking, we, I think we got it. Babe, just take care of him, juice him for all you can, and then tell him to get the fuck out. <laughs> and make sure if he gets you pregnant, name the kid. Yeah. What, what, what? Name the kid Jeff? Fuck no, don't name, <laughs> hate my fucking name. All my fucking, my family has fucking Mexican like tough names, Oscar. You know what I'm saying, Jose! 
Y uno dice, Joaquín, ¿qué, ¿qué quiere? ¿Qué quiere? Es Joaquín, Oscar, José. Y there's Jeff. My name is Jeff Garcia. Thank you very, very much. Good night.